Hey y'all and welcome back to the party. It's me, your girl, Britt Reacts, and today we are reacting to Chris Stapleton sings the national anthem at the Super Bowl. Let's see what he has to sing. To honor America with the That's performance not Chris of Stapleton. the national anthem. Oh, is he the sign language guy? Grammy Award winner, Chris Stapleton. And you see by the dawn's early light. Oh, his face is even more sad now because they lost. Okay, I want y'all to know, and I think I said this in a video recently. I have watched this, um, but I didn't get to enjoy it. I definitely didn't get to hear it. I was at a Super Bowl party. My husband and I went to a Super Bowl party um, with his team. My husband is a basketball coach and all of his uh, colleagues. And we were both in the room like, y'all have to be quiet. Chris Stapleton can really sing. Everybody was like, what? No, he's that, that. You know, everybody was like downplaying it because they don't know who Chris Stapleton is. He doesn't look like somebody they want to hear. You know, you know, people judging books by his cover. And we were like, no, you have to listen. So I feel like the whole time I was fighting for my life to get their attention, to make them listen, that I didn't get to enjoy it. So I'm really excited to re hear this and actually listen to it, honestly, because I know how good he is. I already love what the guitar is doing. What the guitar is doing is sensational. Who's broad stripes and bright? That's beautiful. Through the pain. That's not like color graded. That's not. That's like literally them wearing the colors, or did they like? Is this some type of edit? That's beautiful how the colors like <gasps> fade out. But like seriously, y'all, that doesn't feel like it's like edited a little bit. It's so beautiful. Okay, let's keep going. Who's broad stripes and bright? Hold on now, Chris. Hold on now, Chris. This man's voice, this man's voice. I can't say this underrated because I don't know enough um, about the accolades he receives in the industry. Just as a, a kid, person, human who didn't grow up on his genres of music. And I say genres because he's not in one genre. I've learned that. Um, but it, it's this just feels like I hope enough people understood and appreciated this. This is so good you know a lot of people feel like you have to belt out the national anthem but this this is so delicious like i keep having to rewind it because the things that he's doing the riffs that he's rifting and running through Oh, oh, oh. Woo. 
the church? Did you hear the church? And that last... That's church. That's church. This right here is a penny dropper. Whoa. Y'all still haven't told me who sings that song. That's fine, though. It doesn't matter because Chris Penny dropping Stapleton just made me want to drop them draws to the national anthem, to the star-spangled banner, whilst taking me to church. Because the church flag, the church flag, <laughs> flag, get it? The, the, the church cloth had to come out because he took us to ch some of those runs, them chords, gospel, gospel music. That man can sing like no other. And it's so subtle. I think that's what makes it sexy is that it's effortless and it's subtle. It just is like he really becomes one with that guitar. And what happens next is up to fate. <laughs> that was phenomenal. Like, I, I wish I could hear that in person. And the, the, the man doing the sign language was so passionate. Oh, it was so good. Yeah, yeah. Chris, Penny, dropping Stapleton. I said it. If you're new here, I said it. He was inducted into that that Hall of Fame many, many videos, videos ago. So go back and watch them all because I have been fangirling ever since Tennessee Whiskey. Okay. All right. This was fun. Go have the day you deserve. Peace.